What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you very much for stopping in. So if you've been following along, you know that uh, a few months ago I installed the Traction Concepts LSD conversion kit on the Q50 because the Q50 struggles with an open diff. We struggle with gaining traction, particularly the Q50s with a rear wheel drive car. So the Traction Concepts LSD conversion kit, I gotta say, is one of the best and one of the most important upgrades made to the Q50. It just goes a long way in improving traction capabilities. An open diff is just not conducive to aggressive driving or racing or launching a car. Um, so it, an LSD or this Traction Concepts kit is just a, a great option. Uh, particularly the Traction Concepts kit is a great budget-friendly option uh, to help you maximize your traction and actually increase the performance of your Q50 overall. But I gotta say that I get a lot of questions on those LSD videos or the posts that I make on uh, Instagram or, or TikTok. Uh, people always ask, and I think the questions come from just sort of a, maybe a misunderstanding or a lack of understanding uh, as far as what an LSD actually is. So some of the questions are, what's it like to daily a Q50 with this kit installed? Or I would know, comments come across like, oh, I wouldn't want to drive a, a car with an LSD. And I think, again, that comes from a little bit of a confusion or a little mis misunderstanding. People thinking that an LSD or this Traction Concepts kit is like a welded diff, right? And it, they're totally different things. So while the differential actually welds both axles together essentially and that m makes both of the rear wheels turn at the same rate all of the time. They are connected, they are welded, right? Welded in the differential. So people asking what's it like to drive a car with a welded diff? That's an understandable question because it does change the driving characteristics of a vehicle in daily situations like turning, taking tight turns into a driveway or into a parking spot. You get that chirping, skirting, the, the inside tire wants to spin as fast as the outside tire when you're taking these corners. So it's it's chirping, it's skipping. So you can, it's, it's not as comfortable to drive. It's not as convenient to take these tighter corners or pull into parking lots, for example, or into your driveway. Uh, you can potentially get premature wearing of tires uh, because of situations like that. Um, you know, if you're highway driving and you get out on the open road, it's not such a big deal, but you can definitely tell when you have a welded diff on a car. And you can risk breaking things too, of course. An LSD is a limited slip. It's a limited slip. So that's when the tires start to break loose. That's when they lock together. But when you take these tight corners or you pull into a parking spot or you pull into your driveway at the end of the day, uh, it allows that outside wheel to turn faster and that inside wheel to turn a little bit slower. They're not locked. They, they're only locked when traction is being broken, right? So it's that limited slip. So driving with an LSD is much more comfortable, much more normal, much more natural than driving with a welded diff. The Traction Concepts LSD conversion kit is essentially the same thing. It allows the, the wheels to spin freely when you're taking corners, so there's no noticeable noises, no noticeable chirping, or there is no chirping of tires on these tight corners. You, you don't know that the car has it when you're pulling into a parking spot, uh, but when you put the hammer down and you launch your Q50, both of those tires are gonna spin, and allowing you to maximize your traction. Um, you know, when with an open diff, if you try to launch the Q50, particularly a rear wheel drive Q50, it's going to put all the power to the wheel that is spinning. So you're just not getting the full drive. You're not efficiently using the torque that the car is making and you're dropping dropping lots of time off your zero to 60 and dropping lots of time off your quarter mile times, for example. Um, and also, uh, like if you go to a road like Tail of the Dragon or the Blue Ridge Mountains up in North Carolina, for example, the roads that I like to drive on, the issues with the open diff become very, very prevalent and very obvious. When you try to accelerate out of a corner, uh, either traction control is kicking in or if you turn traction control off, um, you're spinning the outside tire or maybe you're going to spin the inside tire, whatever one break lo breaks loose. That can be very unpredictable, um, but if you're trying to drive spiritedly, it's, it's counterproductive. Right? You're losing momentum, you're losing traction, the car's not working how you want it to work, but I really gotta say that it's the unpredictability that is that was always my biggest frustration with the open diff. You just didn't know how the car was gonna act. Maybe it would grip up, 
get lucky and spend both, or um, you know, you, you turn a corner and the rear end would kick out a little bit, or maybe when you wanted the rear end to kick out a little bit with a little bit of oversteer, have a little fun, it wouldn't do it because you'd just be spinning one tire and the other one would just be doing nothing. So I really didn't like that characteristic of the open diff. Uh, of course, they put open differentials in cars from the factory probably to, I, I, they think it's to protect people or prevent people from getting out of control in inclement weather, for example, you know, rain, snow, cool, cool temperatures. Um, but I honestly feel like an LSD is more safe. Um, you can get used to how the rear end acts in situations like that, or you can learn to control the rear end when your car does that because it's predictable. You know how it's going to act when it spins both of them. You know you might be able to kick the rear out in one direction or the other and, and bring it back safely, whereas that open diff, you just you just don't know. You might continue in a straight line. It might kick you out. You, you just don't know. So I've always hated the open differential. I honestly, I, I just think it's unreasonable for any manufacturer to use them in rear-wheel drive cars, but I guess it is what it is. So back to the point at hand here. What is it like to daily drive a Q50 with the Traction Concepts LSD conversion kit? It's great. It's just like dailying the Q50 from the factory. It's comfortable, no weird noises, um, no uh, premature wear of tires, um, nothing unusual whatsoever. You, you can expect a ride quality as just how it was before installing the kit. Uh, it's very, very simple. You know, uh, you saw the installation process. You saw what the actual kit looks like. There's some very, very uh, strong springs between those two blocks that put pressure against the spider, the uh, spider gears in your rear. And that essentially locks those uh, two axles together when traction starts to, to break loose. And I tested it tested it a bunch you know we did a bunch of launches you could see did a bunch of little burnouts uh, and it works it works just how it should and again driving to work driving to the store pulling into the driveway you wouldn't know that it's in there but as soon as you put the pedal down and you launch that q50 both of those tires spin and you hook and book you turn and burn and that's what it's all about so i highly highly recommend the traction concepts lsd conversion kit guys go back in my channel and check those videos out but i gotta say if you are interested in getting this traction concepts kit installed in your q50 or any car for that matter any platform that is that this kit is ap applicable for uh, go to their website and uh, at checkout use the code scs10 off that's scs for speed culture studios 10 the letter number 10 off scs10 off and you will get 10 percent off your lsd conversion kit it doesn't include the gears but includes the kit itself uh it's if i mean it's already a great deal it's very very budget friendly and it works so take advantage of the opportunity to get 10 percent off it might be just for a limited time only so you want to jump on it as soon as you possibly can i'll put a link to the website in the description below follow it again scs 10 off take advantage 10 percent off the traction concepts lsd conversion kit and that is for real rear wheel drive and not just q50 if you are coming to this video from any platform whatsoever where you are dealing with the shortcomings of an open differential jump on this because the code applies to you as well thank you guys very much for watching this video if you have any traction concepts lsd conversion kit questions leave them in the comments below or just reach out to traction concepts directly they're very very helpful they'll give you all the information you could possibly need and they will uh, help you through the installation process as well great people over there so Thank you again for watching this video. More to come for Speed Culture Studio. So I hope you guys will stick around. We'll see you in the next one.